Coast Pilot question three. Point Judith Harbor of Refuge. So let's look that one up in the index. Let's point Judith. L M N O M O P O pilotage there. We're probably gonna be Point Judith up here. P O I Point Judith. Point Judith Harbor of Refuge. 138. That's 137. 138. Point Judith Harbor of Refuge. Here's Point Judith Harbor of Refuge. I've done these questions a long time and I'm happy to cover this one with you because it's one of the harder questions asked in the Coast Pilot. <clears throat> Sometimes you have to read, we'll have to read this entire chunk of text to find these answers. <clears throat> so choice A, let's, let's get familiar with these choices over here. Choice A is, is used only by toes. B, has moorings for small craft along a breakwater. C, is easily entered in all sea conditions. D, is entered through what is locally known as either the east or west gap. So let's start reading. <clears throat> right here, Point Judith Harbor of Refuge. On the west side of Point Judith is formed by a main V-shaped breakwater and two shore arm breakwaters extending to the shore. The harbor is easy, is easy of access for most vessels except with a heavy southerly sea. So this one is out, is entered easily in all sea conditions. No, because it's hard to enter in a southerly sea. Oh, next sentence. It is used little by toes. It's used only by toes. So these two are out. A and C are out. Now we're looking for has moorings for small craft or D is entered through a dredge cut. And now I'm not going to read this whole thing because I'm sure it'd be a little bit tedious. But let's skip down to here. We'll find another one. The area with the V-shaped breakwater affords protected anchorage for small craft. The breakwater should be given a berth of 200 yards to avoid broken and hard bottom. So this air, this sentence right here rules out, has moorings for small craft along the breakwater. This sentence says, given a berth of 200 yards of that breakwater. So you can't go along the breakwater. You got to give it at least 200 yards. That brings us down to D, which I know is down here. You have to keep reading if it's your first time, but I know it's going to be held in these two paragraphs. So let's let's find D in here. And the answer we're looking for is entered through what is locally known as either the east or west gap. So here we are. The southerly entrance to the harbor of refuge, locally known as the east gap, is 400 yards wide. And the next paragraph says the western entrance to the harbor of refuge locally known as the West Gap. So it's entered through either the East or West Gap. It's locally known as the East or West Gap. So here we go with the correct answer. Three is D. And if we go to the answers, three is D.